Crazy Mike, crazymikesapps.com with an iPad app demo for Hands-On Equations 2 by Bornson and Associates. This application is in the education category, works on the iPad, currently sells for $3.99. There's also an original version, Hands-On Equations, that sells for $4.99, also for the iPad as well. This easy-to-use algebra app picks up with the first version left off and expands on the same great hands-on learning method which includes video instruction, examples, exercises for each lesson, and one overall review lesson. We're going to tap on the video to get a little bit of background on hands-on equation. Well, one of the things with sixth graders, when you say the word algebra, they, they are panicked and they are frightened, and their parents are panicked and frightened. Nine plus X. What's your first legal move? We did. We took it. I think if you're going to teach algebra, you can get rid of all that math phobia that comes with the word algebra at this level if you start them with this kid. So then what do you have? X equals three. X equals three. There's just a lot of evidence that this program. So this is a new learning method for learning algebra. Let's go ahead and tap on the menu of lessons and when you jump into it you're gonna see lessons on the left side 8 to 15. It starts at 8 because the original hands-on equation iPad app went up to lesson 7. I'm gonna go ahead and tap on lesson 8. Each lesson has a video except the review lesson which means there is an extra lesson at the bottom which combines all of the different learning in all the previous lessons. We're gonna tap here on 8 there's video instruction for each lesson. Let's look at lesson number eight. This is the first lesson of level two. We notice that we have a new symbol here. The symbol is that of a star. It's an X with a bar through it. Later on, we will see why, why we write it that way. For now, all we need to know is that star is the name of the white pawn. So on the left side, it says twice three stars plus one. Tap over to the right to continue to the lessons. You can watch the whole video and I suggest doing so because it does explain each lesson. Now you can see here we have 5 star minus 2 star equals star plus 8. Now the star is a symbol and you can see we have two. We have the blue pawn which is going to represent X and in this hands-on equations two we are introduced to the white pawn which is the star we also have our numbers here now again this is based on a real-world physical learning method which includes a balance beam as well as the two different pawns and the number die here and I'm gonna go ahead and figure out how to solve this so we have five star we take five of the star which are the white pawn and put them up there minus two star so we're gonna take two away and we have three star left and then over here we have one star and eight and we drag our number dies and our pawns to correspond to the way the equation is laid out now you go ahead and we're gonna remove one star from here and one star from here which is gonna leave us two star equals eight which means that star is going to equal four. I'm gonna tap up there and I'm pretty sure star equals four. I have a slide wheel once I tap on that space. I can go ahead and press done once I'm confident. Now what I'm going to do is clear the board on the bottom left. It's gonna remove all the pieces off of here and I'm gonna go ahead and insert four where the star is. And I'll say five times four is 20. So I can put 20 up here and I'm gonna minus two times 4 which is 8 so 20 minus 8 is going to be 12 and I'll drag these away put up 12 and then I have star plus 8 which is 4 plus 8 we can put the 4 plus 8 just to help us which we know is 12 and we can go ahead and put that there now when we're sure that they equal we'll go ahead and tap on checking our answer to our problem and we'll go up here and put in 12 press done and we'll do that again and once we do that we're going to go ahead and press done, and you know you've done it right when you get a great and the trumpet sound. So we'll tap on OK, we can go to the next lesson, we can restart this lesson on the bottom left. You can also get help during the actual problem, and it's going to refresh you with the video again. You can also notice that it can be shown on AirPlay as well. Let's go ahead and go to the next problem and it continues to go on with the same method. They're introducing you to the star in this lesson eight. All through the exercises, you're going to learn about the star and solve for the star. Now, if you go out to the main menu, 
you can go down and see there are advanced and it continues from level 9 all the way up to 15. So you have practices here and then you have exercises as well. I can tap over here on exercise and you can see I've done a couple of them. I'm going to tap on exercise 7 and once I do so you're going to see a pretty complicated problem in algebraic words. So how do you do this? We're going to go ahead and do it's going to be 4 X, so we're going to have 4x, which is going to be blue, and we're going to put our 4 up there, plus 10, we're going to put our 10 die up there, and then we have 3x, so we'll put 3 up here, and then we have 13, which is going to be represented by that. Now we're going to remove 3 from here, as well as here, and we're going to be left with 1, we're going to minus 10 there, and we're going to be left with 3. Now we'll go ahead and check this, clear the board, we're going to put 3 for x, and once we're done there, we'll go ahead and solve this. So we will say 2 times 3 is 6, times 3 is 12. So we have 12 plus 10 is going to be 22. So we'll drag that off, leave the 2 up there, and put 22. And then we have 3 times 6 is 9. So we have 9 plus 13, and that's going to be 22 as well. So we'll put our 22 up there, get rid of the 9, and we'll go ahead and put our answer there. And once we do that, again, we're going to check it to make sure we're right. Scroll there, tap there, and then tap in here again. And if you're right, you're going to get the trumpet sound, which means you've solved it correctly. Now we can exit out of here and go into the menu. And I'm just going to go out to some of the harder areas and show you that the problems get quite complicated. You can see they start adding in both the X and the star where you're going to need to solve for both of the symbols. And you'll do that by the same method using the balance beam with the white and blue pawns as well as the number die down here. Again, once you come up with the X as well as the star, you'll go ahead and check your problem by clearing the board. You can also restart the lesson at any time. And you can always advance to next in the upper right. Return to the menu, top left, help review the video during the problem and then you can always go back to the previous problem which was before this one. We're going to head out to the main menu and go back to the menu again. You can see the review lesson down here and when you tap into this just expect that you're going to get a combination of all of the other lessons 8 through 15. I will highly suggest that you start at 8 and don't skip forward because again the building blocks are, are, are presented in lesson 8 and 9 and 10 chronologically. Now you can find out more about Hands-On Equation and Borenson and Associates by tapping on About and you can always return to the front page by tapping on the emblem up in the top right. There you are, you have your menu of lessons. That's it for this iPad app demo. Until next time, Crazy Mike from Crazy Mike's Apps saying see ya.